Hello friends, my name is Ramansur. Today we shall discuss about topic respect. Uh, the concept of respect in project management. Friend, today's topic is very very interesting, especially if you have interest in project management or you are planning to give exam or PMP in the near future. So let's start. First of all, I would request to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell option as well so that my videos can reach to you and also you can follow me on the Facebook page as well. Basically friend, respect is a topic which we have taken from the PIMBO guide project management body of knowledge and this is the topic which is basically pertaining to the code of conduct and uh, the moral values you can say the related to project management basically PIMBO guide is a project management body of knowledge which is a book issued by PMI and it is a uh, PMI is a non-profit based organization which issues different industry standards and best practices for project management when, uh, the concept of respect in project management is basically uh, contributes to the success of a project and the overall well-being of the project team. It involves treating all individuals involved in the project with dignity, valuing their contributions and fostering a positive and inclusive work environment. When, whenever we are working in any organization, uh, whatever the salary you are drawing from the company, whatever the designation you have, and whatever type of project you are working but the most important thing in a project is respect respect for your own self respect for your team member and respect for the time of all the team members so respect is very important if you are getting a very good salary if you are having a very good designation but you are not getting the respect in an organization so obviously friend it is not uh, useful it is totally useless for you uh, if you have ever worked in an organization and you you faced such thing of that so definitely you can recognize that what actually the meaning of that so let's deep dive into it first thing is the team members uh, team members means recognition of expertise expertise means friend that uh, like there are so many types of team members are working some are uh, software manage, uh, software developer some are software designer some are uh, operation manager so different type of team members are working in a, in your uh, project and they have different skills and expertise so friend whatever the uh, work they are doing you must have to recognize their efforts their skills so that the basically the acknowledgement will basically boost their morale and also ensure that individuals feel value for the for their contribution then open communication means creating an environment where team members feel comfortable expressing their ideas thoughts and concerns they feel that whatever they are saying it has a value and a respectful communication involves listening actively providing constructive feedback and acknowledging the input of others so uh, like if you are saying uh, if your team members are saying something and they are getting valued so obviously next time they will definitely more contribute and try to enhance the improve the things as well next is the uh, stakeholders means understanding the perspectives of your stakeholder stakeholder is a person who has interest in, in your project stakeholder can be a CEO from the customer side uh, project manager from the vendor side uh, operation manager from the customer side so end users are also stakeholders so basically stakeholders uh, are could be client sponsor and end user so it means understanding their perspective what they want what their objective what is their expectations and by considering all these factors project managers can make informed decisions that al align with the overall project goals then transparency means that being a project manager you should communicate all the things positively uh, transparently and uh, 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 like neutrally so the project progress challenges issues risk it, those all those things should be communicated properly and transparently and open communication builds trust and helps manage expectations as well time management uh, friend punctuality is very important like time of every team member is very important either it is from vendor side or either from the customer side so like for example uh, meetings should start and end on time deadlines should be communicated and adhere this ensure that everyone's times is valued so like wasting of time is not acceptable at any level conflict resolution 
friend conflict resolution means that uh, whenever we are working for a project there are so many conflicts occur in a project uh, conflicts among the team member conflicts with the project team members uh, conflicts with the uh, c level uh, team members so basically uh, friend conflicts are inevitable in projects and conf conflicts means difference of opinion due to that reasons conflicts occur so project manager should encourage open dialogue mediate conflicts and help team members find common ground so that everyone feels that a win-win solution can be found and this promotes a positive team culture and prevents prolonged disputes that can hinder the progress so that is basically the concept of uh, the conflict resolution friend uh, being a project manager you should be able to handle the conflicts among the team members then appreciation and recognition friend uh, uh, every achievement like if for example the uh, production deployment is completed for a project so all those types of milestones should be acknowledged properly on email and our written format and also uh, it should be appreciated as well for example for appreciation uh, you can give awards to team members uh, you can uh, have some simple expressions or gratitudes uh, you can give some uh, certificates as well. You can have some lunch or dinner outside. So all those things are basically a way to appreciate and recognize the teamwork. Then cultural sensitivity. Uh, friend, uh, whenever we are working in a project where different cultures, uh, people belonging to different cultures are working, so we must have to be adhered to the cultural differences and understanding and appreciating the different diverse perspectives contribute to a more inclusive and productive working environment. So uh, obviously culture is very sensitive to everyone and um, when the people belonging to different cultural uh, many times it happens that issues occur and uh, difference of opinion occur so we must have to adhere about that and take care about that as well then work life balance uh, friend uh, work is also very important but uh, everyone has their own personal lives family life so uh, there should be a balance uh, between the work and between the personal lives uh, Obviously, it, if there is a balance between uh, work life, so obviously it will enhance the office work, it will enhance the productivity as well. Resource allocation means that the resources should be allocated appropriately and fairly for the workload and uh, uh, so that uh, everyone feels that they have a responsibility, they have the opportunity and it should not happen that all the uh, due to some favoritism like uh, uh, avoid the favoritism ensuring that each team member has a fair share of the workload. So friend, respect in project management encompasses a range of behaviors and attitudes that prioritize the well-being and contributions of individuals involved in the project. It creates a positive and collaborative environment leading to improved team morale, enhanced communication and ultimately project success. So friend, thank you. Thanks a lot for watching the video. I hope you like this video. If you like it, please share it with your friends and colleagues and thanks a lot for watching.